Hello everybody, welcome to the channel. My name is Jay God. In today's video, we're gonna talk about the last major update in Black Ops 4. And the update should be the 1.24 update in the operation that is supposed to start on September 23rd. As you can see on the screen is Operation Dark Divide. And this is a little different than all of our other previous updates. This is actually gonna start and take place on a Monday. Normally update days are either Tuesdays or Fridays. So that being Monday is gonna be a little bit different, but not a huge deal. Just make sure that you're prepared for that particular switch if you're on PlayStation, obviously one week later will be for Xbox and PC. When we take a look at the event, what we're gonna see here is that Treyarch has announced first details on the next operation. Heroes will rise Operation Dark Divide, which comes to Black Ops 4 on September 23rd, PS4, and then all other platforms to follow, which I've already kind of mentioned. Um, and then pretty much the operation will feature the last Zombies DLC map alongside the final two maps included with the Black Ops Pass. Obviously, if you have the Black Ops Pass, that means it's over at that point. All the content up to this point is included, but for any future DLC content in the form of maps, you're going to have to pay extra for. So right here, um, it also says that more details on the content overview, uh, new operation is set to be announced as we get closer to the start date. I would expect to see that Friday the 20th to kind of get everyone's head wrapped around what's going to be coming to the game, build a little bit of hype, generate some excitement. That's kind of the direction I think they're going to go when it comes to this particular update. But one thing I did want to let you guys know because they're obviously going to try and hype it out. But overall, I'm not expecting a ton of great stuff from this update that is actually free. As we've seen in a lot of the previous updates, as the year has gone on, the updates have progressively gotten more microtransaction based so that if you're not spending money in this game, you're not really getting much in return. I do have a couple of these ultra weapon bribes. So if they decide to drop some DLC weapons, which are almost 100% going to be in these reserves. At least I'll have a chance at them, and hopefully you guys are saving yours as well. And the rest of it is just going to be cosmetic. And what I mean by that is literally if we look at the blackjack shop, there's 10 items here on this first little tab, 10 items on the second tab, three, uh, another 10 items on this third tab. So there's like 30 items here that are all purchasable in-game but not earnable, right? Which, which is kind of defeats the whole purpose. If I go over here and I click play video, which is right here on this screen, it will play the video. And if you look at all this stuff, black market weapon, reserves, soak death effect, reserves, bat wing jumpsuit, I believe it's reserves, paradise weapon camo, reserves, evergreen, pretty much all the stuff that's in this video was pretty much reserves. We didn't really get anything. Black market right there, black market weapon, reserves, shards, reserves. So don't expect anything that they're going to add and anything in these types of trailers are going to actually be earnable within game. So don't get too hyped on the event other than the fact that obviously we have some new content to hopefully unlock because you're saving reserves or you have those ultra weapon bribes. I just want to be open and transparent with you because this is the last major update of BO4. Most of the devs have already moved on to Black Ops 5 and working on that content. So I wouldn't expect a ton of content from this game coming in the second year that's pretty much all i wanted to talk about quick event video hopefully you guys did enjoy it in some way if you did hit the like button if you're brand new around here like to find your way back for more call of duty content make sure you do subscribe with notifications on we'll see you on the next one thank you for watching as always have a great day